comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. Dixon and Dixon and all his reindeers blowing on the rain. been a good girl this year. I mean, I think so, and I hope so. I really want Santa to visit me this year. I mean, he did last year, but I'm just worried. Oh, I'm sure he will. Mom, is Santa even real? Why, of course he's real. Whatever gave you that idea? I don't know. My friends talk about it a lot and say that he's not real, but I just don't know what to think. Well, darling, I think you should believe in all Christmas magic, because it is all real after all. Yeah, I guess so. I just... I don't know. I promise you, Santa and all Christmas wishes are real. Hey, London. Hey there, Caspian. Are you excited for Christmas? Oh yeah, super excited, but I really am really grateful for you. Oh, Caspian, that's so sweet. I'm really grateful for you too. Aw, aren't they just the sweetest? I know, Delta. They're so cute together. I really hope Firefly doesn't come between them. Ugh, look at those two. I know. Aren't they just so romantic? Uh, you're on her side too? Why wouldn't I be? Because he broke my heart. I was in love with him, and he doesn't love me back. Well, Firefly, that is how love works. I mean, if someone doesn't love you back, that's kind of the reaction. <sighs> Clipso, you don't know anything. Stay out of this. <sighs> you involved me. <sighs> Whatever. Hey, Everest, uh, do you know when Aura will be back? Well, I mean, not for a while, I guess. I mean, her human really likes to go riding a lot. Well, yes, I suppose. I just hope she makes it before dark. Don't worry, she will. Hey, when are Platinum and Equinox coming back? I'm not really the one to ask. I didn't know they were gone. Aren't you helpful? Wow guys, the forest is really pretty this time of year. I know, it's gorgeous. It really is. I'm surprised we haven't done this more often. Yeah, me too. Hey, bet I can beat you to that tree over there. <laughs> no way. Okay, you're on. Come on guys, you better catch up. Oh, you're in for it. Ha! I win! Aw, oh, darn. Aw, oh, man. Who knew Frisians were so fast? He is pretty quick. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty obvious. Guys, wait, I think we missed something back there. Well, let's go check it out. Aw, oh, it's a little barn. Yeah, but there's little foals inside. Who leaves foals out just like this in the winter time? Aw, <laughs> oh, they're so cute. What breed do you think they are? I think they're Arabians. Look at their faces. Oh yeah, so true. Well guys, it is getting pretty late. We should go back. Yeah, you're right. Let's go. Come on, last one to the stables is a rotten egg. Hey, you got a head start. Guys, wait for me. Hey look, they're back. Hey guys, how's the hack? It was great. How's lover boy? Oh, you know, in a daze. <laughs> Makes sense. How was it, Aura? Oh, it was so lovely. The forest is beautiful at this time of year. Oh, I wish I could have gone. It's okay. Maybe next time. Bye, Platinum. See you tomorrow, boy. Bye, Equinox. Bye, Aura. See you tomorrow. Uh, hi, London. <laughs> I know, Caspian. London. <laughs> I know. London. Hmm? Oh, what? Oh, sorry. Bye, Caspian. Bye. Uh, all right, yep, come on, yep, come on. Uh, sorry, Aura. I just got a bit sidetracked. <laughs> I'm guessing she's still love-crazed? Oh yeah, big time. Hey, how's the hat, guys? 
it was good. We went exploring, but uh, we found this little barn thing and it was kind of abandoned and there were these like little foals in them, but like, <laughs> it's probably fine. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, it was really weird. Okay, good morning everyone. Morning, Megan. So it's almost Christmas and this barn needs to have some Christmas spirit. So I need you all to just go over to the big tree over there and put any sort of horsey kind of festive things around the tree and then we'll make it look really great for our party. All right, yeah, sure. Sounds great, but I have a lot of stuff to do with Atlas. I still have to teach him tricks. I have to take my lesson, Ugh, so many things. All right, Jordan, I know you're excited, but you need to help out with this, okay? You can write him after. Ugh, okay. Stephanie, I need to talk to you about something. Why, what's going on? I don't know. I mean, seeing the foals the other day in that little place, I mean, that's just concerning. Like, what if the owner isn't there? Oh, I'm sure there is one. Don't jump to conclusions every time, Skye. I promise it's fine. But seriously, Stephanie, I, I'm worried about it. Skylar, seriously? We're just setting up for a Christmas party. We can go riding later if that makes you feel better. Uh, yeah, okay. And we can bring Mia, okay? Everything is fine. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Wow, really great job, everyone. Really great job, guys. I really like how it turned out. Um, okay, so you guys can do whatever you want for now until we need to set up more, but really great job. <laughs> Thanks, Megan. Yeah, thank you. I'm coming, Atlas. I'm coming. Hey, Mia, we're gonna go back to the full stall if you want to come. Sure, I mean, that was a really fun trail ride. Well, she means not only for a trail ride, but because she's worried. You're worried? About what? I don't know. I just have this awful feeling that there's no one there to take care of them. Oh, I'm sure there is. That's what I keep telling her. Ugh, seriously, guys. Please. Ugh, fine, Sky. Back at it again? Yeah, Skylar's worried about that little foal situation out there. Oh, <laughs> makes sense. Guys, come on, let's go. Are you out on that trail ride again? Yep, Skylar's worried. Well, I do know that my girl has a good sense of what's going on, so maybe she's right. I don't know, maybe. Where are you three off to? Oh, we're going out to this place in the woods. It's really cool. It has these two, two little strawberry patches, right? Um, what? Strawberry patches don't grow in the winter. Well, these ones in particular are very, very, um, magical. Yeah, so they're still growing, so we're gonna go, we're gonna, we're, yeah, we're gonna go examine them and, you know? Ugh, whatever. I can't believe I actually go to this barn with you all. <laughs> Picking strawberries in winter. Seriously. Yeah, <laughs> pretty crazy. Okay, guys, we're going. Now. Okay, we're here. And look, they're fine. What? Are you joking? No, they're not. Ugh. They haven't moved since yesterday. Well, it is quite cramped in there. Maybe they just can't move. But again, who would just leave foals in here? I don't know, Skye. Maybe there's a reason for it. Yeah, like maybe there's something wrong with them or something. Ugh. I don't know, guys. This just doesn't seem right. Seriously, Skye, you don't need to worry about stuff all the time. Yeah, and the weather said it was going to snow later today, and I do not want to get caught in that. Seriously, guys, come on. What if these were your horses? What would you do? Well, then I'd be more concerned, but these foals obviously would have to have some sort of owner for them to be in here in the first place. I guess that's true. Ugh. Seriously, Skye, it's already starting to snow, and we're still here? Poof, it's cold. Yeah, seriously, let's just go back. Ugh, guys, you very well know that we're not that far away from the stables and can gallop away whenever we want to. Can we just stay here in case someone comes back? I just want to know. Sorry, I'm going back. Are you coming, Mia? Right behind you. But, but girls... Sky, seriously, there's nothing to worry about. Sorry, little guys. Girls, girls! Oh, hey Sky, what's up? 
I was right. There's, there's no one, sorry, there's no one there. What do you mean no one there? Don't tell me this is about the foals. Um, what foals? It is, but there's seriously no one there to look after them. I did a little bit of research and I asked around yesterday and no one has heard of that little place in the woods. Well, maybe it's someone from out of town. I checked that too. Seriously, no one has ever been there. Okay, are you guys going to keep arguing or are you going to fill me in? Ugh, we were off trail riding a couple days ago and we came across this little place, you know, like a stall with some foals in it. Ugh, Skylar's worried about it. Well, there's probably someone there. That's what we keep saying, but she doesn't believe us. More like the other way around. They don't believe me. There is no one there to look after them, and they are going to freeze. Well, if there's foals, doesn't there have to be a mother? Right. In comes my theory. So the foals look pretty young, from what I can tell. So the mother must have died when they were young. Or younger. So what I'm thinking, since it's been so cold, she might have just been too weak to take care of her two babies. And she must have just put them in there because she thought it would be warm. That's why it's abandoned. You come up with the most wild of accusations. Why won't you girls believe me? Listen, Skye, we know that you love to go on these adventures, but seriously, it just isn't like that in the real world. Guys, I am seriously not joking. I mean, I would have to agree with me and Stephanie. I mean, stuff like that just doesn't really happen. And how do you know, Chloe? I just do. Like, <laughs> I just do. Okay, and I also trust logic. See? What is all that commotion? I think they're talking about some sort of abandoned foals out in the wilderness. Well, that's certainly not good. But what are they arguing about? They should go and save them. I don't know. Let me ask Sunday. Sunday? Sunday? What's going on in there? Well, the girls seem to have found an abandoned little barn out there and found foals in it. Oh, it's so nerve-wracking. And Skylar is trying to convince them that there's no one there, but the other girls won't listen to her. Well, why don't they? That's perfectly reasonable. I know, they just don't believe her. Well, this is quite crazy. I mean, they should go and save the little darlings. The poor things will freeze. I can't imagine if my poor baby Peppermint was out there all alone. Same with my baby Wisp. Ugh, that is awful. Simply awful. Sky, just let it go. It's Christmas Eve. But guys... Ugh, fine. We will go out there with you. Really? Yeah, but we want to stay here for the Christmas party a little bit. I mean, not right now. But Mia, I thought we were against this. Stephanie, she was never going to let up in the first place. And, you know, maybe it will make her feel better. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> This is really such a lovely Christmas party. I know, it really is. I just wish I could be with my Caspian. You guys really can't get enough of each other. Nope. Ugh, look at them. Ugh. Simply disgraceful. Disgraceful. Oh, come on, Firefly. It's Christmas Eve. Where's your Christmas spirit? Back there with my broken heart. Oh gosh, is it really that bad? Yes, it is. Now I'd prefer not to talk about it. It was a dreadful situation. Well, uh, maybe you'd like to tell me. Perhaps it would get rid of some of that, um, grinchiness? Ugh, I suppose so. I'm so glad we're not out today. Yeah, but, I mean, maybe Skylar's right. I mean, it is kind of strange that there's just random foals sitting out there, but, you know, I'm sure they're fine. Girls and boys, I have some very exciting news. It's supposed to snow tonight. Isn't that exciting, everyone? Yeah, so exciting. Guys, no, it's not. We have to ride out there. Oh, I bet you girls will make it back in time. I don't think it's supposed to snow for a while. Why are you being so supportive of this? I don't know. <laughs> like, I actually don't. But if you girls are going to beat that storm, you better go now. Oh darn. I was just about to get some hot cocoa. <sighs> and those cookies look so good. Ugh. Fine. Come on, everyone, get your horses. Platinum, Equinox, here, boy. Well, looks like we're going out. Guess so. Come on, boy, let's get you tacked. Aura! Are you going out again? I suppose so. Well, I heard there's supposed to be a snowstorm tonight, so hurry back. I will, Delta. Don't worry. Come on, girl. All right, girls, hurry back. Don't worry, we will.
Look guys, see, I told you. Oh, the poor things, they look so cold. I know, and the snow is starting to pick up. Guys, we have to get them out of here. We have to get them back to the barn. Yeah, you're right. I'm gonna see if we can get some help. I'll ride back. Okay, be careful. What are we gonna do? I mean, the poor things, they probably can't even walk, they're so cold. I know, they're gonna be too weak. What if we use their horses? No, they're probably too cold. They're dead weight. That's too heavy. Yeah, you're right, but how are we going to get them back? Hmm. Always worth spreading a little bit of Christmas magic. That should get them home. Whoa! Did you see that? That sleigh, it, it just appeared. And look, there's harnesses. But how, we've never put on harnesses before. Let alone, our horses don't even know how to pull. Well, first time for everything, I guess. But Sky, Mia, I know it's crazy, but these foals need to get somewhere warm, now. Help, help! Whoa, Stephanie, what's going on? Mia, Skylar, and I were out in the woods, and we came across this little barn with foals in them, and now they're frozen to the core. So we're trying to get them out right now, but we don't know how. I came for help. I'm sorry, Stephanie, but I don't know if there's much we can do. But we can't just leave them out there without nothing. I know some people out there. Maybe they'll find them, but we can't do anything here. Why? The lights have gone out. The snow is too heavy. We were just trying to clean things up now. But Mimi, James. I'm sorry, Stephanie, there really isn't anything we can do. I've got an idea. So, what's your idea? Well, we just need to start up the backup generator. Then the lights will shine bright and we'll guide them back. That's a great idea. Equinox, I'm scared. I've never pulled a sleigh, let alone in the snow. It's okay, Aura. We'll be fine. I mean, we've got good sense of direction, and I've had a little practice with pulling. You have? Yeah, I did a little bit at my old barn, but I haven't done it in a while. But I know we can get through this, okay? We just have to keep our heads up high. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I'm all good on my side. All good here. Um, I put my tack and yours in the back, um, but now we really need to get those foals in. Yes, but how? Do you think they'll be able to get in? I mean, not just by themselves. We'll have to help them, of course. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Easy, little girl. It's okay. Come on, buddy. You're going to be fine. Look, there's even a blanket in the back. Oh, perfect. There. All nice and warm. You're sure you know how to drive? I've done it like once, but yeah, sure. Just make sure that they're warm back there. All right, Aura. You got this. I don't know. Okay, Equinox, Aura. We believe in you. You can do it. Okay? Aura, you're doing it. I know, I really am. But yeah, come on, guys. You really are enjoying this. I mean, who wouldn't? Whoa, easy, guys. Why have we stopped? I... I, I don't know where we are. What? You don't know where we are? Sky, this is serious. These foals are getting colder by the minute and you don't know where we are? I'm sorry, I can't see. The snow is too thick. We'll just have to hope for a Christmas miracle. Oh gosh, did you hear? I heard. Aura and Equinox are out there. I know, and apparently there's two little foals. Oh, this is not good. And there's no way we can help. I know. Oh, Eclipse, this is simply not good. I know, I heard. Ugh, those poor deers. I know, Aura and Equinox, and those tiny foals. I hope they make it back okay. Ugh, Equinox, what are we gonna do? We're gonna freeze. Aura, calm down. We'll find a way back, I know it. Equinox, I know you're trying to be positive here, but seriously, no, we are not. We will, I know we will. I can just tweak this back here. It should bring the lights on. Come on, Chloe, hurry. I'm going as fast as I can. Jeez. Almost there. Got it. Yes, nice, Chloe. Now, let's just hope that they can get back. Yeah. Whoa, what is that? It's 
Phoenix Stables. <sighs> Alright. Come on, Equinox. Come on, Aura. Follow the lights. See, I told you it would work out. We're not home yet. Whoa, you guys are not gonna believe what I'm seeing. Santa! No, it's Skylar and Mia. Yes, we did it, Chloe. I knew we would. Skylar? Mia? That's us. And is that Equinox and Aura? Pulling a sleigh? Sure is. And we brought company. <laughs> oh, you got them. Yes, and they're still quite cold, so we need to get them into a stall fast. I can't believe you made it all the way back in a snowstorm. I mean, no thanks to Chloe and Stephanie. Yeah, without us, you would have never made it back. I suppose that's true. Really nice job, girls. Yes, amazing job, but where'd you get all the driving equipment? Well, it really is Christmas magic. It showed up out of nowhere. Yeah, it was so cool. All right, girls, untack those horses and put them in their paddocks. Okay, can you take care of the foals? Of course. Equinox! Wow, so you really pulled a sleigh? I mean, not by myself, but yeah. Wow, that takes guts. That's really amazing. No, <laughs> thanks. Aura! Hi, girls. I can't believe you did that. That's so brave. You've never even pulled before. I know, I was super scared, but Equinox wouldn't let me. So we got through together. Oh, that's so cute. I know. I'm just glad I'm home and warm in my blanket. Aw, would you look at those little ones? Aw. You guys weren't even awake when I was pulling. Look at how cute you are. Aw, <laughs> oh, that's adorable. We're just glad you guys made it back safe. Yeah, it was pretty rough. Yeah, well, you're here, and that's the best thing. Aw, Caspian. Aw, look at those little foals. They're so adorable. It's really lucky that you found them, guys. Otherwise, they would have froze. See, I told you. Yeah, I know, I'm sorry. Me too. Well, guys, the snow seems to be letting up. We can still have our party after all. Yay! I'm just so happy that our horses were able to pull the sleigh. They've never even driven before. I know, we're really lucky. It really is a Christmas miracle. It sure is. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow.